for you guys, I have my Amazon swimsuit haul today. There's no other option, not even a hook, so it's more like an aesthetic, like an aesthetically pleasing accessory. <laughs> Hi everybody and welcome back to my channel, Divine Mix. Today I have a very, very summer focused haul for you guys. I have my Amazon swimsuit haul today. I have six different sets of swimsuits and each and every single one comes with their own version of a cover up. So let's see if they live up to the hype or if not. <laughs> so my first swimsuit is actually the Sweaty Rocks Women's Three Piece Gradient Tie Dye Bathing Suit Lace Up High Cut Bikini with Beach Skirts. Don't get me started. I already know Amazon has the longest, longest names for no reason. Now I will say this, the, the reason I got this swimsuit in the first place was I saw the picture and I was just like, oh my gosh, it's so gorgeous. The color is so rich, it's so vibrant. And I will tell you right now, whatever color you see on your screens when you go to Amazon, it is the exact same thing. It is just as vibrant, it is just as colorful, it is rich, it is beautiful. Now, the top itself had the most negatives for me. And the reason for that is because like the colored fabric, this part is so much, how do I put it? It's so much looser or bigger than the inside fabric. So the white fabric that's inside. Now, because of that, it, I personally feel like, especially towards the bottom area, it gives off a little bit of frumpiness because it's just like, it's too much fabric one way. I feel like the fabrics aren't equal and it's not meshing or not lining up perfectly. Now, the strings. The strings on the top of the swimsuit, it's not those like little circular strings that you see on swimsuit. It's literally the like front and back. And the problem with this is on one side, you can see all the stitching and the seams and it does not match too, too well. It's like a yellow, whereas this part is orange. Um, I'm actually now noticing this part kind of bends a bit too much. <laughs> But yeah, it's like a yellow, so you have to watch yourself just to make sure that the seaming and everything is on the side of your body instead of displayed outright. You won't really notice too much though unless you look real close, but it is a bit off putting up close. Now the bottom fits snug as well. Um, just check the back to make sure once again that white inner lining part is not showing. Now, other than that, right, the sarong is my favorite part of this whole swimsuit. It is soft. It is a vibrant. It's so, so stretchy. I ha I've never had a sarong that stretches so, so much, but I love it. And I was <laughs> other than that, I would say like this, this swimsuit is so bright, so vibrant. I kind of felt like I looked a little bit pale in it. Um, but I think that's just because the color is just so, it's like sunset. It's like sunset on a swimsuit. And I think aside from those little things, it's, it's honestly, it's a pretty good swimsuit. So let's, let's just go to the next one. <laughs> All right, guys, so this one here is called the Florence Women's Three-Piece Bathing Suit Underwire Bikini Set with Beach Skirt. And yes, this swimsuit has an underwire in it, which is both uncomfortable and form-flattering as possible. <laughs> um, so I did look at the reviews for this, and I went up a size, and I'm happy I did for the bottoms because the bottoms are, are snug. And if I went with my regular size, it would have been way too tight, way too uncomfortable. Now for the top, I wish the back was adjustable. It's a clasp on the back 
it's just like a little choo choo and that's it there's no other option not even a hook so you can make your own whatever no other option for this it's literally just a clasp so it is it's not as tight as i personally would have liked it especially for the top and then even if you do the straps up here they don't help too 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 much now when i looked at this on amazon the color was it was a much darker color it literally how would i put it it looked like the sea like when you go and you go to the beach and you know those deeper parts it, it, it was that type of deep rich blue this one is like kitty pool type of blue <laughs> like it's it's so much so much lighter so i just wish it was a bit darker because i think the the attempts at the gold flex would have been stood out more and the marbling effect would have been more pronounced now if you are looking for some cleavage action i do think this swimsuit is for you because the underwire and how it's styled it definitely helps to lift even if you don't have a lot um the sarong though the sarong it's a bit stretchier than i anticipated but not as much as the last one we just tried on overall though i'm i'm happy with it because even with the sarong on you can't really see your bikini bottoms from the back or anything so it is a it does what it's supposed to do, which is cover you up a bit. Now, I I don't know why I'm not 100% on this one. I'm just a bit hesitant about it. I think because I was expecting like a different color. I was expecting some adjustableness with it and not getting that and I, I personally feel like when it comes to swimsuits you need to be able to adjust it not everybody that wears a small is this is the same type of well endowed not everybody who wears a large you know it's the same like there are some girls who might need a large even though they're very very small for their own reasons or things like that so i think overall it just needs to be a bit more adjustable to accommodate different sizes i think if the bag had even just the string tie it would have really made a huge huge difference um other than that like the the underwire it's so stiff it keeps its shape and i don't know if that like stiffness is something i personally want in a swimsuit maybe if i'm going out on a boat or something or the, a yacht party or whatever maybe maybe this will work because i'm not really intending to move around a lot i'm not intending to swim but overall mm, this this one has to be one of my lowest liked swimsuits in this haul so let's just get to the next one let's just bring some happiness back <laughs> All right guys, so I am bringing color and life back into this and I'm taking a chapter out of the Shy Swimsuit Ladies Playbook. This one is for those of you that don't feel too, too comfortable showing a lot of skin out on the beach. You still wanna feel beautiful. You still wanna feel like a top dime, but you're just a little bit hesitant when it comes to your body don't worry i got you covered i also feel that way sometimes so i got this one which is the wdi rara um with rara women's two-piece tie-dye bikini swimsuit ring monokini with bikini bottom this one essentially is like if swimsuits were dresses this would be it it's beautiful um so i actually went up a size with this as well and the bottoms were still a bit tight so the swimsuit bottoms not the actual monokini part just the swimsuit bottoms but that who knows maybe after some time it could stretch out it doesn't need to stretch out too too much for it to be comfortable um so it's like 
if they were snug and then slightly tight, that's where it's at. So I'm just hoping it loosens a bit after wear, but honestly, because of the monokini part, nobody would notice. Nobody would notice. You can't even see the swimsuit bottoms through the monokini itself. It is a perfect cover-up. It's cute, it's sexy, and it's colorful enough to like draw attention to the color and not to your body if that's what you're going for. Now, I won't lie, <laughs> because of the colors, I feel a little bit like a pinata <laughs> because I, I honestly, I feel like I have literally seen a pinata in these colors, but it's okay. I will stick to being the life of the party. That is fine. Now, I am a little bit worried about the ring in the middle because I have had to deal with clothes before that had that ring and some of them did not have the proper ring. So after washing it even one or two times, it started to rust a little bit. This one feels like plastic. So I think at most that gold might flake off, but it should still be good. It shouldn't actually do too, too much. Now, This, this set has a lot of straps. You have one and the two that goes around the back, but then you have one more, which is there literally just for design. So with that being said, if you want to go crazy with a design on the back to add a little bit, like maybe tie this top one to one of the ones on the bottom, you absolutely can. You can have fun with it. Or you could keep it plain and simple like I do because I don't feel like tying that many ropes together. But overall, um, just that one strap, which is literally just there for like decoration purposes, it's both necessary and unnecessary at the same time. It really depends um, on you and what you want and what you like. And Yeah, that's, that's pretty much it. I think I even mentioned before that the skirt portion of the monokini, it is not see-through. Well, it's mesh, but for I don't know if it's because of the color. You cannot see really, like you can't see through it at all. Like, unless you're like this close. And then honestly, if someone's this close to your butt, they, they either, have seen it before or that you need to smack them away um but yeah it's like really really close and this one this one actually just makes me feel like i could have fun with it Cause sometimes i don't like going in a swimsuit and then going off to the side to like let's say get a drink or something i always feel uncomfortable um or or like awkward out of place because you see everybody in there regular clothes and you're just going there so this one i think like even if you aren't in a regular clothes you'll feel a bit more comfortable a little bit less insecure so this one this one gets two thumbs up for me i loved it i wish i had something like this when i was younger and i was chubby <laughs> it would have been perfect i would have been out at the beach all day so let's go to the next one Okay guys, this one is the Verduso Women's 4-Pack Halter Triangle Bikini Swimsuit with Tassel Cover-Up Set. Now, when I think of this swimsuit, and it's the reason I got it, I was just like, this is like Havana Nights. Do you not, do you not see these tassels? It's fun. <laughs> um, I will say the best thing about this swimsuit is that you get a, it's literally four pieces a regular basic black swimsuit where the top you can tie drawstring around the bottom doesn't have the side ties but then you also get a two-piece like this this cover up part now this top you can wear on your own you can wear it with something else whatever you want even the skirt if you want to do that as well um but essentially you're getting four pieces for the price of one bikini which is fantastic um i will say that how do i put it the bottoms itself of the swimsuit of the swimsuit portion it is because it doesn't have the side ties it's a bit tight and it like 
few. <laughs> um, but outside of that, right? The bikini portion is just perfect. It's fine outside of that tightness that's on the bottom. Now, if it goes to the cover up, the cover up I had a few little hiccups with, like for instance, this top part, it doesn't stay down no matter what you do. You'll have to tuck it into the sides of the bikini just to hold it down. If not, it goes up, like it just lifts up the whole time. As for the bottoms, this is part was my biggest disappointment because the bottoms in the picture, it looked like a nice bodycon fit, like a nice hugging fitted skirt type of thing with a little bit of stretch, but it's not. It's literally like, I don't know if you know those old jean skirts where they just like straight, didn't, didn't mesh to your body, just like, <laughs> just straight. It's like that, which, in a way I get because if it's like that when you're dancing around you're moving and then the tassels are going everywhere it's just gonna be fun um, so I will say this right if you are going to a pool party beach party or going to like a pool bar or whatever this this is it because you could go in the water you could come out of it you you won't feel awkward, you'll be fine. Um, but outside of that, I mean, that's, yeah, that's that's really all I have to say is that I wish the bottoms, the bottom portion on both the swimsuit and the cover up, they had the most hiccups. Outside of that, like everything is fairly decent. And I am making it a little bit edgy with this one. I am doing the Oyo Angle Women's Three Piece Tie Dye Bikini Sets Bathing Suit Halter Triangle Tie Side Swimsuit with Cover Up. Yes, I know it is a long name, but, but this one. Like, it's a bit low cut on the bottoms, so I don't know if maybe you have to go a size up if you really want more coverage or not. And, like, the cover itself, this one, which I, now that I have it on, it's, I like it because it's edgy, it's cool, it's different. It's not entirely a cover up, but it's more like an aesthetic, like an aesthetically pleasing accessory. <laughs> um, but, I was scared to put it on because it's snug along the arms and I just really didn't want to rip it. Nothing ripped. It stretches a little bit, but I just was a bit scared when it came to it. Now the top is beautiful. This honestly, in terms of all the actual swimsuit portions of all these sets, this one, the triangle bikini, it's the most basic, the most streamlined triangle bikini with the ties like the sides on the ties and the ties on the sides and everything but the ribbing and the detail and the feel on this it feels amazing it feels beautiful i think honestly if i was just going based off of the swimsuit portion this one is my favorite i really really think this is my absolute favorite just for the fit, the style, and the comfort. Uh, I will say though, know, two things. One, the ribbing on this, great. It adds, it, I don't know if that's what makes it so comfortable, but two, this top, I was actually a bit scared when I first put it on because I thought I put it on backwards. I did not put it on backwards, but it took me some time. The smaller part, the smaller part, <laughs> It um, it's the one that goes to the front. But other than that, yeah, I wish I wish the neckline was just a little bit lower, so it would make a bit more sense having it a bit lower down here. But overall, though, this I think this one really is my favorite swimsuit. All right, guys, so we finally made it to the last swimsuit in this haul, and I'm bringing color back into the mix. This is the three-piece swimsuit for women padded floral string bikini set bathing suit set sexy cutout high neck mesh 
Beach cover up. I do think it is the longest name out of all the swimsuits I have here. And I, I did say this with the last one, but it's the same with this also that the bottoms itself are low cut. I don't know if that's just the style or if I should have gone up another size. Um, I, honestly, it could, it literally could be the style and my body is just a bit weird. The top has a hook clasp though. So you just like put it in. My only problem with that is every time I've seen something with a hook clasp, there's usually like two or three more holes so that way you could adjust it. This one does not have that. Yes, the string is stretchy, but I still wished for some adjustableness to it, which would make me feel a bit more secure. Now, this cover itself was not as stretchy as I would have liked. Um, the top part right here where the seam is for the neck, it's a bit stiff. I'm hoping that when you get it wet or maybe after you wash it the first time, it loosens up and softens up a bit. But other than that, it's it's stiff. Once you get through it though, it doesn't really touch your neck so you don't feel choked. Um, but it's just stiff in that one particular area and I feel like anything close to your neck should be soft and comforting. Now, in terms of the cover-up itself, it is a lot shorter than I anticipated. I actually expected it to be like mid-thigh at least because there's an adjustable part that you could like hike it up a little bit or not. And honestly, if you hike it up all the way, you just got butt out for days. Um, but also because of how short it is, I feel like the adjustable part on the side, it's not even necessary. Like it's, and then even in terms of function, uh, functionality, like the string comes out on the top and the bottom so you can tie it, but then when you do it like that, it really looks bad. So I don't know. There's a lot of like, you know how if you have too many ideas in one thing, I feel like this is one of those things where it's just too many ideas and it could have been toned down and some of that could have been taken out. Um, <laughs> but yeah, yeah, I, I like the color. I like the marbling. They do have a lot of other colors as well that I think would be great. It's very true to the picture. I just, I wish it was just a little bit longer. I wish the time on the side wasn't as like out there. Um, and I wish there was some adjustableness when it comes to the bikini itself from both top and bottom. I'm starting to not be a fan of the string bikinis that you just put it up and, and they're just tight and snug. I like some type of adjustableness to it. But now that that is over and we have gotten through everything, this was all my swimsuit hauls. I definitely have a few favorites in there and then there's some that may hopefully, hopefully, hopefully grow on me. I really hope for that. Um, but yeah, let me know if you liked any of these swimsuits, if you have any recommendations or even suggestions for even like making a swimsuit fit a bit better or something. Um, I'm all down to here and let me know if there's actually even any swimsuit brands I should check out as well. So thank you so much and bye.